Hello YouTubers, welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to look at the Samsung uh, leak water sensor. I'm going to show you how to open it and replace the battery very quickly. This should be a relatively quick video. So I'm not sure if everyone's is the same, um, but if we look at the bottom, we have sort of uh, two sort of uh, sensors, the actual sensor at the bottom with the barcode facing downwards. Uh, you actually see, if you do, look very closely just underneath the tab, um, you'll see there's actually an arrow that says open, right? So very easily, uh, you know, if you're not actually looking at it properly, you might actually miss that. Uh, but all you need to do is from the bottom up, push it up with your little bit of force and you'll hear it snap open like that. And there you go. Very easy, very easy to open it. You don't have to try and pry it open with, with the with a screwdriver or anything. Uh, just kind of take a look, see if you can see the arrow. Maybe the, the stickers aren't consistent. So uh, you might have the arrow at the top of the other side, right? So, so I'm gonna just take this battery out here and I'll show you what's inside just for those that need to replace it. Again, very easy. You know, it's got the spring at the bottom, which is um, typically the negative side. Just trying to see if I can actually see inside there. Yeah, so if you actually look inside, uh, you'll see negative at the bottom, which is a spring load, um, and you'll see positive at the top, which is a plus sign. Okay, so if we look at the battery itself, it's a, a CR2 lithium, lithium, looks like it's a three volt volt battery. If you can actually see that, in this case, it's a Lysan battery. Uh, these aren't chargeable, rechargeable, so don't try and put them into a charger. Anyway, you should be able to buy a pack of of six of these off Amazon. I'll put a link in my description for you. Just click on that link; it'll help let the channel grow. And it'll help me out and I do would appreciate it. So um but yeah, typically these will go around anywhere between about eighteen dollars for a pack of six. So look for the ones with a pack of six. Uh you can get them into larger packs like packs of twelve as well. Uh, I'll, I'll put a link in, in the description as well for you guys. But it's a CR2 lithium three volt battery uh that you can replace, right? And as I I'll show you again. If you put the battery in if you needed to actually replace it. Yeah, if you look inside the lid, you'll see there's two plates at the bottom. Uh, just make sure they match the two plates on the top of your watch your holder. And there you go. Very easy, very quick. Anyway, I hope you found the video useful. If you did, hit the like button and consider subscribing to the channel. I hope to make a lot of more sort of... Um, videos just on reviews and things in general uh you know it's some sort of tech tips and things that you might find useful um but yeah hope, hope you found that useful thanks for watching